Hey guys, my name is Chetan Asnur and today we're gonna install the first flight ROM version 5.5 on Galaxy S4 and ND500. And as you can see, I'm using the LA95 ROM right now. So, first of all, I'll have to install the version 5 of the first flight ROM, then I'll have to OTA update the 5.5 version so first of all we're just gonna turn off our device and now we're gonna go into the custom recovery and to do that we're just gonna press volume up key home key and power key at the same time and now we're gonna let go of the power key and as you can see that the device is booting into the custom recovery now And now we're gonna go in wipe and we're gonna go in advanced wipe and my, I'm gonna select the Dalvik cache, cache system data preload and if you wanna wipe your internal storage as well so you can select the internal storage and we're gonna swipe to confirm flash and now we're gonna go back back and back and we're gonna go in install and we're gonna select the micro SD card because the ROM is in my micro SD card and first of all I'm gonna select the first flight and 7 themed version 5 and we're gonna swipe to confirm flash and the ROM does come with the ROM installer so we're gonna select next next and next and we're gonna full wipe next and it want, uh, we're gonna agree to that and next and next and we're gonna go with the deep loaded version and next and I'm gonna select the S4, no heads up display enabled and normal and I want the Viper for Android, I want the exposed framework next, next and it is now installing the ROM and the ROM is now installed so we're gonna select next and we're gonna reboot the device and as you can see that the device is booting up now and this is the new logo and in this the background is white and the Samsung logo is black So the device just booted up and we're just gonna quickly set it up so we can move on with the installation process further. And the setup process is done now so we're just gonna boot into the custom recovery once again. Now we're gonna go in install and we're gonna go into the micro SD card once again and we're gonna select the first light OTA version 5.5 and we're gonna swipe to confirm flash and now we're gonna reboot the system once again so the device just booted up and is now optimizing app so we're just gonna wait for it to optimize app so the device just booted up and we are now up to the 5.5 version I guess and now we're gonna go in it about device and as you can see that the ROM version is 5.5 and the ROM looks really great and I'm just gonna use this device for few days as my daily driver and then I'm gonna post out the review for this ROM and I 
really think that I would like this ROM because it is really clean and all and it is very deep loaded and I think that's it. Thanks for watching guys.